Hey everybody, so this is my week two weigh-in. I hope you like my background. I'm taking advantage of my son's chalkboard wall. My glasses are fogging up, so I'm going to take them off so I can see you. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, I'm going to make this short and sweet. Um, I weighed in this morning and I am down 1.8. Yay! So I'm super excited about that. So my current weight is now... 295.2 and I will share a picture for proof um, yeah I think this week went pretty well I'm pretty proud of myself I am a little bit surprised because I really wasn't tracking as well as I should be and I didn't drink as much water as I could have been so that is definitely going to be things I want to improve on this coming week I have this little journal that I got <clears throat> One of my cousins was getting rid of some stuff, and my grandmother found this in the box and asked if I want it, and I said, yeah, sure. So, it's just a little Mickey book, and um, it's just a bunch of blank pages. I don't know if you can see it. Um, but basically, I'm keeping track of my weights and stuff like that. So, um, what I did was I kind of like wrote down my weight, and like how I felt about it, and then just different things, like thoughts about the week, and like what I can improve on. So... Definitely tracking my food is definitely one of the things I'm going to improve on this coming week and drinking more water. Um, I actually just empty the milk jug so I will be making the cute little uh, milk jug that has like all the inspirational motivational quotes all over it with like the times to know when I have to drink each amount by. Um, I shared that in both of our Facebook groups but I will share a picture here so you can see it. Um, and just no more like crap snacks like I had ice cream a few times this week which I know is I shouldn't have but I did anyway and so but I'm definitely not going to be doing that this coming week just knowing that I did that I lost without doing 100% makes me excited for when I am going to do 100% this coming week um, another goal of mine for the upcoming week is to move more I really didn't do any physical activity except for like some laundry and stuff so I definitely want to try to do some sort of exercise routine. I'm home alone all day, so I definitely shouldn't have an excuse of why I can't do it. Aside from the fact that I'm just sitting around feeling sorry for myself. I also want to start wearing my Fitbit a lot this week because I haven't worn it in quite a while. I took it off to plug it in to charge it and I just like never put it back on. And so I <clears throat> I just need to put it back on. It's, it's, it's as easy as that. Um, I know that when I do have it on, I'm very more aware of my movement and activity for the day and joining your all's challenges and stuff, so I definitely want to get back into that. Uh, goals for October, since we are in a new month, um, I want to lose between 8 and 10 pounds this week, this week, <laughs> that would be nice, this month, that is my ultimate goal. If I don't make it, I'm not going to beat myself up, but I am going to be a little disappointed, so... I'm going to try really hard to get that done. Um, and then I want to take measurements at the end of the month. I haven't taken measurements in a few months just because I really haven't done much as far as loss goes. Um, but my new total right now, I was at 20 pounds last week. So we're at 21.8 pounds this week. Um, so hopefully I'll be just keep, you know, getting down lower and lower and lower and um seeing mid 280s hopefully at the end of the month and i should see a huge difference in measurements so that's one thing i definitely want to do by the end of the month um and then i did share this in the no excuses club on facebook but if you're not part of that uh, i did set myself like a large goal to lose 30 pounds by my son's third birthday which is in december um, i want to do that because i've always had this dream which might sound crazy maybe somebody can out there can relate we've always had this dream of going to a like family function or a party or something and seeing people i haven't seen in a really long time and just kind of like wowing them like oh my god kristen you look so great what have you been doing like i want to be that person and so his birthday party will be on the 19th of december his birthday is the 18th um so that will probably be the day I weigh in and I want to be able to report to you that my new total is 30 pounds or more. Um, that's about 11 weeks from now. I wasn't including this weigh in because I really didn't know how it was going to go. 
Um, so I think I calculated it to be right around two and a half pounds a week for the next 11 weeks, which I'm a little nervous, but I really am excited. I think I can do it. So um, you guys have already motivated me a ton. I love seeing your videos and seeing your positivity and stuff and that definitely keeps me wanting to keep going. Um, I feel so good. I'm so glad that I kind of just restarted everything. So thank you all again for your support and love. Um, <clears throat> if you have any questions about the chalkboard wall behind me, this is, I am in my son's room. I think I already mentioned that in the beginning of the video. Um, but I did film a room tour for his new big boy room, which you may have seen bits and pieces of here and there. Um, I know a week or so ago, you probably saw what his room looked like before. It was a hot mess. So uh, if you're interested in that, I've already uploaded it before you see this. Well, I should have, or right around the same time. So just go ahead and uh, go on over and watch that video and tell me what you guys think. I'm super proud of this room. So. With that said, I will be going. Thank you all so much again for your support and love. And yeah, I will talk to you guys later. Bye.